Hello everyone. Here's your addition practice if you want to pause now and do it first before the word problem to get your brain warmed up. This week's word problem says, Ms. Egley wants to water her garden. The capacity of her watering can is 20 cups, so that means it can hold 20 cups of water. She asks Mr. Ronsi for some help. He passes her seven cups of water. How many more cups does she still need? Time to, there's no water in my watering can, but I want to water my garden. I know, I'll ask Mr. Ronsi for help. Oh, hello, Mrs. Egley. How are you? I understand you're also doing some gardening today and you need some water for your watering can? I'll be with you in a minute. Here's the first cup. Thank you. This is one cup, the first cup. Second cup now, right? Here you go, but what do you need all this water for? I need all the water to water my garden. I'm putting it in my watering can, Mr. Ronsi. Mr. Ronsi helped me. He kept passing me cup after cup of water, and we kept counting saying first, second, third, fourth, and then on to the fifth after the fourth. Okay, so now it's a fifth cup of water, five cups. I don't know what you need all this water for. I think we're at the fifth cup. We're now at six cups of water. Thank you. I believe this is going to be the last one. Seven cups of water. There you go, Miss Egley. The seventh cup. Thank you, Mr. Ronsi. Thank you for your help. It's not quite full yet. I only have seven cups in here. Oh, but this watering can says it takes 20 cups. I wonder how many more I need to put in there. One more time. Your word problem today says, Ms. Egley wants to water her garden. The capacity of her watering can is 20 cups. She asks Mr. Ronsi for some help. He passes her seven cups of water. How many more cups does she still need? Enjoy your math.